Lubbock County Judge Tom Head and Commissioner Mark Heinrich went into great detail last night on our air about why it's necessary to raise the tax rate by 1.7 cents the next fiscal year. Here's the crux of the matter and across the board pay increases needed for the attorneys on the DA staff to keep them from being poached by higher paying counties. And the sheriff needs to expand his staff by seven deputies to reduce call response times, minimize officer fatigue, and reduce the turnaround time for investigations. But that's not all. Judge Head says he and the county must be prepared for many contingencies, one that he particularly fears if President Obama is reelected. He is going to try to hand over the sovereignty of the United States to the UN. Mm -hmm. Okay, what's going to happen when that happens? Mm -hmm. I'm thinking worst case scenario. Right, now. right. Okay. I understand. Civil unrest, civil disobedience, civil war, maybe. I and mean, we're not talking just a few riots here and demonstrations. Mm -hmm. We're talking. We're talking Lexington, Concord, take up arms and get rid of the guy. Mm -hmm. Okay, now what's going to happen if we do that, if mm -hmm. the public decides to do that? Mm -hmm. He's going to send in UN troops. I don't want them in Lubbock County. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. so I'm going to stand in front of their pers armored personnel carriers and say, you're not coming in here. Mm -hmm. And the sheriff, I've already asked him, I said, are you going to back me? He said, yeah, I'll back you. Mm -hmm. Well, I don't want a bunch of rookies back there. True. I want trained, equipped, seasoned veteran officers mm -hmm. to back me. Whether you agree with the judge or think his theories are unrealistic, the reality is a tax hike that will provide an additional $832,433 coupled with about a $2 million cut to make these numbers work. You can sound off at two public hearings tomorrow morning at 10 and Monday, August 27th, also at 10. Both hearings are at Commissioner's Court.